That's from him. Save that letter. Go in now. Save that letter. Daniel, Fonso. Yep, it's on. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to uh, Bill Chase the Movies. After a holiday sabbatical, we are back with an astonishing 20 films, but do not worry. I'm trying to shorten the reviews a little bit, at least here. So let's get right down to it as we wrap up the final films of 2010. And first up is The Tourist, and it stars Johnny Depp and Angelina Jolie in what is definitely a Hollywood heavyweight combo, and that's understating it. Both had hits this year, Depp with his memorable turn as the Mad Hatter in Alice in Wonderland, and Jolie, of course, in the fun action paper, Salt. Now, this film is, of course, decent enough for what it was, but in the at first, anyway, but in the last hour, it turned into an utterly preposterous hash of cliché scenes that have nothing of substance to them at all and nor, nor, nothing enjoyable in terms of the plot twist except to make the audience go, wow, what a twist, without the wow. Anyway, uh, I can't even remember the last time that I didn't like a Johnny Depp film, to be quite honest with you. Um, his level of consistency is probably higher than anyone in Hollywood, I'd say even higher than Leonardo DiCaprio. But uh, here he just comes up with something short. And this is the film where I really can't blame the filmmakers for taking the yeah, extra's big paycheck, but it looked good on paper, from what I've read anyway. And it, to, to me, it could have been something else. And they probably thought, this is one of those films that easily could have turned out better, but didn't. And I really don't think you can fault either Depp or Jolie here. They do have pretty good chemistry. And uh, they are trying everything they possibly can here, but... It, it really takes its cliché straight up, and that's what kind of ruins this film. Uh, it's not terrible. There are some good moments and some laughs here, too. There's also some good supporting work from the likes of uh, Paul Bet Bettany and Stephen Burkoff. Now, again, of course, you know the whole thing. You know, Jolie is a mysterious woman on a train. De Depp is a lowly teacher on vacation out in Europe. And, you know, and again, she, is she a cop, spy, con artist, whatever? And he may or may not be being set up as a fall guy, yada, yada, yada. I don't want to give too much away because I know a lot of people probably still want to see this who haven't. With the two stars like this, of course, uh, I'd be, I wouldn't be surprised. But surprisingly, due to the fact that these two are consistent successes at the box office, this film hasn't been a master success at the box office thus far. But I guess maybe, maybe people are just seeing through it. So I give The Tourist two stars out of five. 